Hello, my name is Garrett, and today we're going to look at my hair dope recipe. As a friendly disclaimer, make sure you check out all of these essential oils on a small part of your body, just to make sure it's not going to harm anything before you put it in your hair. So make sure you have this little spray bottle and a funnel ready to go, and the links to these will be in the video description below, as well as the full recipe for this hair dope recipe. This recipe is what I found works best for my long, curly dry hair not so dry scalp but not a greasy scalp but it just works the best for me and it could work the best for you if you are a guy with long curly hair and it ends up being dry especially in the winter time I really just want to enjoy my hair as long as I can without looking like Nicolas Cage in the movie Con Air we're going to be using a few carrier oils you'll see here in a second and those carrier oils are just used to dilute the very potent essential oils and the first thing we're going to add is this liquid coconut oil. It is good for a dry scalp. It just helps put more oil in it. And there's one tablespoon of that. On the flip side of that, we're going to go with almond oil, which is a lighter weight carrier oil, good for an oily scalp to make your scalp not as oily. The next carrier oil is vitamin E oil, and it is good for dry, frizzy hair and thinning hair. It just kind of helps revitalize it and repair it. Next up is argan oil and this is the one that most people have heard a lot about in the hair industry and it's, it has a lot of vitamin E in argan oil and so it also reduces frizziness, boosts shine, repairs hair. It's just kind of a, a strong carrier oil for hair. The first essential oil up is lavender and it is an antibacterial so it helps contribute to cleaning your scalp. Next up is rosemary, and it is more well known to use this oil for hair care. Studies show that it can improve hair thickness and promote hair growth. And last up is ylang ylang, and it is good for reducing hair breakage. I know I have a lot of hair breakage like in the winter time when my hair is the most dry. And once you're done adding everything to it, you can give it a good shake. And after you get out of the shower with your wet hair, give it three hits and spread it on throughout your hair and then I normally just comb everything through my hair and it seems to work out great.